You're welcome to my Virtual DJ Effects Tutorial Episode 2. In the Episode 1, we learn the first method on how to use the backspin to scratch. And if you haven't watched it, go and check it out. Also the link is in the description down below. So in today's episode, I'm going to teach the second method on how to scratch with the backspin. And that is hot cue and the backspin. Please if you are new here don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell for next episodes. Now let's go to our settings. Click on controllers and click on advanced editor. Now type in the key you prefer to use for the action and type in this script hot underscore q1. Now copy it and paste it in another key. And change the 1 to 2, so we will get to hot cues. You can do this as many as you want. So this is our hot cues. Click on panel to switch to hot cue. Or click on pad page and select hot cues. In this hot cues, if you haven't set a cue and you click on the cue, or you press on the key that we map for the hot cue, it will set that particular hot cue either hot q1 or 2 and if you have set the hot cues and you press on the cue it will start the song at that particular cue in the song I, I, I. so let's set our hot cue take note that we only map hot q1 and hot q2 on the keyboard so we are going to set hot q1 and 2 in the song for the scratch click on the one to set hot q1 and click on the 2 to set hot cue 2. And if you want to delete the hot cue, click on this close symbol to delete it. Now let's go to the backspin mapping script. This is the script for the backspin. So this script will backspin the song while you pressed on the key. And let's go to backspin effect settings. Turn on the stop on end and set the length to 2.76 seconds. In this backspin settings, if you click on the backspin or press on the key, it will backspin and stop the song on the end of the backspin. So now let's learn how to play with the keys, step by steps. And don't forget to give it a like for more tutorials like this. Step 1. You will click on the hot cue first, either hot cue 1 or 2, and second click on the backspin. Do it two times, and one click on the hot cue to start the song or sampler. Step 2, you will click on the backspin first, and second click on the hot cue. Do this four times and one click on the backspin. Let's combine step 1 and step 2 together. Let's scratch it on the instrumental. Please 
please subscribe, like, share, and comment. And in case you haven't watched the episode 1, check the link in the description down below. So in next episode I'm going to teach how to do transition with the backspin. Thanks for watching. See you in next episode.